Hello. Yes. Okay. Okay. Good afternoon, sir. Okay, okay, okay. Good afternoon. Combination of two simple harmonic motions at the right angle to each other that is completed. The next one is today, uh, discuss about in a damped harmonic oscillations. That is a unit three, that is a damped harmonic oscillation. Yes, it is audible. It is clear. My voice is yes, clear. Sir. Yeah. Okay, okay, right, right. Yes. Okay. So, the unit three that is a damp damp harmonic damp harmonic. So, first of all, what is the damped harmonic oscillation? Okay, so damped means, damped means, what is the damp? What is the meaning of damped? Anyone? Hello? Hello? Anyone who tell that what is the damp? No idea, sir. So damping means is a damping like this is a wave formation. Okay. So formation of waves, it is damped. So this uh, damping means we are doing like that opposite force, apply the opposite force. So Vasavi, please go to mute. So in the opposite force, for example, in the bike, okay, bike it is moving in the line which is the bike, bike, okay. So in this bike, in the moment of when we have to apply the momentum on in our bike, then the bike is, it is moving. So in the moving, so first one is, is a restoring or uh, is a damping force. So two forces applicable. For example, is a frictional force from the wheels. This opponent force is frictional force from the wheels. This is the first one force. Okay. So next one is, is a second one force is opponent A force, opponent A force, okay. When we have to start in our bike, the, the bike is moving, when the moving of in our bike, so it is applied the two opponent forces, this is the first one force. For example, frictional force, frictional force means this it is attached to in our road, okay. When it is attached to in our road, it is a form of in our frictional force, okay. So this is the opponent force. So next one is the second one force is air force. Air force, two forces we have to apply on the bike in the bike. So whenever we have to stop the bike function, so uh, two forces need to be it is applied to opposite forces. So that's why so after some time it's come to constant position because of already this force applied in the opposite. Okay, so in the same way, is a damped harmonic oscillation. So harmonic oscillations means is a motion of motion of motion of our vibrations. It is formed when we are to add the vibrations to the system. In the vibration system, it is applied the opponent force. So first one force is 
that is the frictional force that first one force is it is frictional force frictional force means we have to attach it to two ends or one are free second one is one are free second one is fixed okay in the fixed point it is frictional to spring to stand like this okay this is a frictional force applied so next one is is the second one force is come on hello So first one forces. So sorry for the disturbance. So first one forces that is a frictional force. So second one force is is a elastic force. Okay. So let me show you. So let me show you. Let me run it for you. Let me ask you. Ah, put it there. After we ask you, John. So two forces are it is applied on the motion of wave. Motion of wave. So motion of wave. So we have to consider the we have to consider the x dimension of x dimension of spring force for example in the spring force so we have to fix it in the first one and in the end of position is a form of frictional force hello हेलो बुकलेट जिसको बोले थे सर बुकलेट जिसको बोले थे सिंगल पासिंग बोले थे जिसको बोले थे सर बुकलेट हाँ हाँ इन इपुर मेरे लैब में होगा ये तो So this is the first one force is the frictional force attached to we have to attach to a nerve strand like this any one is the form of a nerve frictional force. So this is the second one force is the elastic force that is a minus k x is a connected by equal to minus k x. K means this is a k means constant. Next one is x is dimension. X is dimension. So minus indication is is a opponent force is a opponent force. So next one is is a frictional force is a frictional force we have to denote it uh, minus r dx by dt minus r dx by dt. Okay. So this is a frictional force dx by dt means is a direction and this is a r means this is a momentum of another opponent momentum this opponent means the symbol of minus r okay so two two forces we have to we have to hide it because of when we have to apply the force on the spring then the spring is moving when the spring is moving so so two forces is a frictional and Elastic forces, two forces we have to apply these are opponents. So the right that is a minus symbol, minus symbol. Okay. So finally, finally we have to apply forces according to another Newton's second law. So applied forces, you know that one before one. So m into d square x by dt square. What is that? F equal to m a. Okay. F equal to m a. A means what is that? Acceleration. M means mass of the particle. So Applied forces, applied forces, F equal to m a or m into d square x by d t square. Applied force that is 
equivalent opposite forces applied on the system group. So these are equivalent opposing forces is what is that? Minus R dx by dt and minus kx. Two forces we have to write it in the RHS side. LHS side is applied force. Then RHS side is we have to write the opponent forces. Okay, both forces is equal. Then the then the spring or any one system is come to constant position. Constant position. Okay, so that is a damping condition. That is a damp damp to harmonic. Oscillator equation we have to form. Okay, all of it is clear. Yes, all of it is clear. If any doors, Emma. Hello, sir. Oxar explanation. Akil. Damp put damp put mean ko arda main da. Damp put and take to arda main da. Damping. Damped harmonic oscillations at the end of my name, the name of the name just to give me an heading again. No, no, what is the damped? What is the conditions we have to apply in the system? Are they Japan? I can work at the mind. I am just no one. Other than sir, so friction and minus kx same direction and the opposite force. For example, I am moving to now. Okay. Na? मन मुंक मूवर भार्गव ओके मुझे मूवे मन की फूड की रोड की मध्य फ्रिशन फोर्स अप्लीकेबल फर् एग्जापल बैक स्टार्ट आफ भार्गव बैक स्टार्ट वन किमीटर के वेल्न तरह अभी मन आफ्जन तरह अदे स्पीड तीड अदे स्मूत प्लेस स्मूथ प्लेस रफ प्लेस स्मूथ प्लेस इंक मूवल स्टाप पोजिशन को सुन कर दा अधे रस्मूथ पोजिशन उन्हें मोस्ट में मुंडू को मोस्ट में ना ट्रांड आपको नेट आउटर नेट लगा दा डायरेक्ट का फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स कर दा बार गो क्लियर ओके ओके राइट सो दैट्स व्हाई वी टू मिड द माइनस माइनस ऑफ आर डीएक्स बाय डीडी आला फिर इस क्लियर यस राइट वेरी गुड ओके So, first of all, we have to apply the force on the spring or body. So, applied force is according to Newton's second law, F equal to m a. So, F equal to m a. M means mass, a a means acceleration. You know that one. What is the equation of a? That is a equal to d square x by dt square. Okay. Before one class, I will be explain. I explain that. Okay. So, in the F equal to m a. Therefore, in the f into d square x by d d square already already explained in this uh, uh, condition m into d square x by d d square f equal to m a we have to apply the force on the spring when we have to apply the force then the spring is vibrations spring is vibration when the spring is vibrations so two forces are applicable frictional force and elastic forces these are opponent so that is that is equal to minus k r Minus of R into dx by dt is the opponent forces. All of it is clear in this equation. If any doubts, so after that, this is a derivation easy. M J S M one by one, one by one subject put. First of all, it is clear or not? You say that. It is clear or not the equation? Yes, sir. Right, very good. Okay, so continuation. You say that one is a m into d square x by so uh, can you adjust the board properly you can't see the reflection of light now it is okay okay okay, okay. all right okay right okay. m into d square x by dt square plus r into dx by dt 
plus k x or k or any one k x direction vector vector k x equal to zero. Is clear? So in the RHS of equations which come to in the LHS position, so that's why the negative vector equal to zero. Okay, right. So next one is d square x by d d square plus r by m. M is come to in the uh, second term. There is a r by m. So d x by d d plus k by k by k by m into x equal to zero. This is equation number one. Up to equation number one, clear? Yes. If you any doubts in the equation one? No, sir. Yes. No doubt, possible. Okay, sir. Is completed. Yes, sir. Right. Completed, sir. Yes, sir. Very good. So next one is in the in this equation one. This is first one equation is d square x by d t square. Uh, that is Rajesh. Please go to mute. Rajesh. Rajesh. Right. Okay. So in the equation one, this is the first one is d square x by d d square is a second order differential equation of a damped harmonic oscillator. Okay. So next one is uh, the first term of the represents the <coughs> acceleration. Acceleration in the second term is velocity. Is the second term is velocity and the third term it is denoted by the displacement displacement of wave. Is the first one term is acceleration of another wave. Is the second term is velocity. Third term is is the displacement of wave. Is the wave forms so is the r is denoted uh, yes. small r is denoted by what? What? Smaller. By m into d x by d t is nothing but a velocity. Okay, velocity. It's a velocity velocity formation of equation. Okay, right. So next one is in this equation r by m. In this equation r by m equal to we have to consider to be and k by m equal to omega square n by two. The equation of one. Okay, so in the equation one is it is form of d square x by d t square plus uh, r by m means what is that? We are write that to be two b of d x by d t plus omega square k by m means omega square. We are write it omega square x into x. We are write the equal to zero. Or uh, we are write the this is the in the equation number. This is the second equation. Second equation is second equation is d square x by d square plus two b dx by 
it implies omega square x equal to zero. This is the damped harmonic oscillator equation. Damped harmonic oscillator equation. So in this equation, we have to write the solution of equation. In the before one class, we have to write the solution of. We have to assume the one equation. So that equation we have to finalize that. So finally, we get the another equation. That equation is the solution of another. Uh, a simple harmonic equation. So in the yesterday class we have to discuss in the in the same way is the equation damped harmonic oscillation equation. So in this equation we have to write the solution of equation. We have to assume solution of equation. We have to write it. After that we have to we have to write it. Finally we will get the one equation. One equation is this is the finalized equation is this is the correct equation. Assumed equation is wrong equation. We have to write it in the same way. So first one is is a damped harmonic oscillator equation. Then let we have to let the solution of equation to x equal to a e to the power of alpha t e to the power of alpha t. We have to assume the we have to assume the solution of equation. Okay, right. Firstly, you can write it note down firstly. Right here, but the second equation after that, let the solution of equation after that x equal to a to the power of alpha t can be. This is the equation number three. Is completed? Is completed or not? Completed, sir. Right. Completed, completed, sir. Completed, sir. Right. So a and alpha are the arbitrary constant. You can write it. A and alpha are the arbitrary. Constant a and alpha n is the arbitrary constant, right? So listen, listen to carefully. Next one is we have to understand or not? At the moment, that's a pain. Emma, yes, yes, sir. All right, yes, sir. Right, right, thank you. So. This is a second. This is a assumed equation. This is a assumed equation is solution of another second equation. Okay, right. So this assumed equation is x equal to a to the power of alpha alpha t square. Okay, this is a so our equation is d square x by dt square. This is a second order. This is a second order. So means what is the this is a assumed equation. Assumed equations we are to we are to equal to in the Second order formation. So second order formation means what is that? We are to differentiating in the double differentiating dx by dt and d square x by dt square. So that is equal to in the second order formation. Okay. So in the assumed equation is x x equal to a to the power of alpha t. So next one is this is a dx by dt equal to a e to the power of a e to the power of A alpha e to the power of alpha t. This is a second order. This is a first order equation. So next one is and this is a d square x by dt square formation is d square x by dt square formation is this is a a into alpha square e to the power of alpha t. So it comes in the second order form. Second order formation. It is equal to in the second equation. It is clear. It is clear or not? 
okay d square x by dd square all of you pandu what about you hello okay sir okay sir right right okay thank you no doubt our assumed equation is no doubt sir yes your our assumed equation is so we are to differentiating up to in the formation of second degree so first degree and second degree equation we got to apply it in the second equation so damped harmonic equation in the damped harmonic equation finally we will get the one equation that is solution of an our equation right now the firstly Is completed. Complete. Completed, sir. Right, right. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, dx, dx by dt and t square x by dt value is applicable. Yes, sir. Second equation, no. Applicable, yes, sir. Not clear, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I mean, the place of t square x by dt is a alpha square a to the power of alpha t. The place of dx by dt means a. A alpha to the power of alpha t is operated. So our equation is.
squaring equations minus b plus r minus under root of b square minus omega square root by 2ab this formula is there जंगे सर लेकर एंट्री फॉर्म लेदा Under root of under root of 
d square minus omega square is not zero is not zero but it is it is equal to very small quantity so that is under root of d square minus omega square equal to h tends to zero you have to assume that we have to assume that ikkada equation chudan what is that alpha 1 alpha 2 okay d square equal to omega square you have to sort unsatisfied in the alpha 1 alpha 2 equation so so that why we have to write the small value that is b square under root of b square minus omega square s tends to h h tends to 0 we can write it so in this value we have to apply in the equation equation finally we will get the one equation the equation is it is satisfied to in the satisfied to in the equation of one equation of one okay so small correction in our d square equal to omega square equation so what is the correction of you you see that one okay so s continues you have to follow it or not hello hello you have to follow it or not follow it sir follow it sir okay so the we have test books we test books unnai amma yes sir unnai unnai chusunnaru kada follow avutunnaru kada yes sir page number 34 and 35 yes sir okay it is clear clear sir right right very good so this is a p square equal to omega square name is critical damping critical damping our writing is critical damping critical critical damping so the critical damping p square equal to omega square is not satisfied in the solution so this is a p square minus omega square under root of p square minus omega square equal to h tends to 0 to put it so in the equation of in the equation of half uh, equation of alpha 1 and alpha 2 is alpha 2 is to put it in the final so x equal to in the a1 exponential of minus b plus h t plus a2 in the exponential of minus b minus h into b okay so in the under root of b square minus omega square plus you put the h value you put the h value okay so finally in the equation is e to the power of minus bd into a1 e to the power of x t plus e to the power of a2 a2 e to the power of minus x t yes it is clear it is clear ikkada ora clear aagu doubt unda amma under root of b square minus omega square plus you put the h just h value so finally so it is the power of minus b t a into a1 e to the power of h t plus a2 e to the power of minus h t you put it if you any doubts if you any doubts no sir no sir so in the e to the power of h t means in the on the expansion of e to the power of h t value that is uh, 1 plus h t 1 plus 2 h t 1 plus 3 h t 1 plus 4 h t up to n plus n h t n h t okay so for example in the e to the power of minus h t you have to expand it that is the expanded value is minus h t plus 2 h t minus 3 h t plus 4 h t minus 5 h t like up to minus of nhd okay like this we can write it so you see that one the formation is e to the power of minus e to the power of minus bd into a1 
e to the power of x t means you have to expand it like this cosine sine values okay there is a 1 plus h t plus up to so on plus a2 into 1 minus 1 minus h t plus up to so on to so on finally in the equation is e to the power of minus b t minus b t so a1 plus a2 common plus next one is remaining value is h t h t is a1 minus a2 it is clear first one is a1 plus a2 second one is h t is common that is a1 a1 minus a2 so finally we will get the equation that equation is critical damping equation so that is the e to the power of minus b t so these are a1 plus a2 is we put the p that is a p plus these are a1 minus a2 we put the h so that is a h a1 a1 minus a2 we put the q that is a q p q t in the equation so a1 plus a2 is is a perfect a1 plus a2 is p and in the q equal to h plus a1 minus a2 okay so this is the equation e to the power of minus pt p plus qt this is the equation number continuation is one equation is one equation okay this is a critical damping of equation so last one equation so that is the that is a under damped equation number under damped equation this is a critical damping equation is clear if you have any doubts in the critical damping am i doubts in a critical damping equation low no sir no yes what about no, borgo no, sir akil borgo no sir no right no don't ask it no Yes, yes, no doubt. Hello, sir. Hello, class. I put that in there. I put in that contact. All forty-six. I know. Kado.
రన్నింగ్ ఉండేనా ఇంతసేపు ఎన్ని గంటలకు స్టార్ట్ అయ్యండి క్లాస్ అప్పుడేనా అప్పుడే అయిపోతుంది అయిపోయినా వన్కి అయిపోతుంది క్లాస్ అంటే ఇంకా ఫిఫ్టీన్ మినిట్స్ ఉంది కదా ఇంకా ఫిఫ్టీన్ ట్వంటీ మినిట్స్ హలో సార్ లేనట్టున్నారు సార్ కాదు ఇప్పుడు ఫోన్ లాగా ఉంది ఈ ఫోన్ లా కాదు అక్క ఫోన్ లా అయితే రికార్డింగ్ చేసుకోవచ్చు అక్క దానిలో ఒక సిస్టమ్ ఉంటది అది ఫోన్ నుంచి వస్తుంది ఫోన్ ల్యాప్టాప్ ల్యాప్టాప్ లా సిమ్ కావాలి దాన్ని సిమ్ రాదు దానిలా ఫోన్ లా వాళ్ళు కొత్తది దాన్ని బ్యాంక్ చేయాలి జియో లేవు కదా సమ్మన్ దగ్గర ఒకటి అక్క దగ్గర ఒకటి అక్కది దాని దీనిలో ఉండే వేసేసుకు కొత్త ఫోన్ కొన్నాక వేసేసుకుంది ఇన్వర్టెడ్ వాళ్ళు ఉండాలి కదా వేసుకుంటా వేసుకుంటా సిమ్ కావాలి కదా నీ పేరు మీద నాని ఏజ్ లేదు మన ఆధార్ అనుకుంటా సార్ ఇంకా అంటే పైసలు ఇస్తాను నేను కానీ నెల నెలకి వారం వారానికి ఏనికే తెలియదు కదా నేను తెలివి ఉంటుంది నీ ఫోన్ ఇంట్లో ఉంటుందని తెలియదు కదా స్విచ్ ఆఫ్ చేసి మళ్ళీ నెట్ ఆన్ చేసి కొట్టి వన్ థర్టీ కొంది మంది పవర్ ఆఫ్ చేస్తున్నా కదా
Halo, Sir. Hello, anyone there? Hello. Hello. 